Ako na kazi poa tena sana na ako na gari just to flavor that. That's a cocktail already. Na ako na kila kitu. So ki mkatiyo neza mwambia nini? That is a question right there. And I've seen some of your feedback, man. I love it, I love it, I love it. There's somebody who's mentioned, uh-huh. All right, uh, anajita Gerald Mbiki on X. Anasema, makueni wote well represented. Uyo demo promise you are to love, affection, na attention. Okay, because she already has everything. Like we've just said, when Esther was broke, but then Esther is established. So he needs, she needs another established guy. Another one says, a savior, savi, and asema, love, respect, and attention. And then he says he's watching live from Kayola. Love it. Uh -huh. Another one says, Dominic Nyabuta, and asema, oh, we and asema, beziake nyako tuned in. Mm -hmm. there's, there's an interesting one. Yeah, here it is. And asema, good morning, Rafael Dekush. And asema, good morning. Good morning to you from this side. The Pearl of Kenya, County of Heroes, Place of Knowledge, most decor. Okay. You're praising your tribe. But that's a good one as well. Mm -hmm. Somebody has shouted the wife and everyone. But anyways, that is the conversation we are having right here with my guests uh, who are with, live with me in the studio. And I'm being joined live by Enoch Nyamogo. He, is, he has so many titles, but we'll get to that in just a bit. And then Jeff Crispin as well. Karibuni sana. Let me brand. start off with you, Enoch, now that you have so many titles. You just had uh, that meme when Esther was broke. But was black asked, and broke. Or was black and, and broke. broke. Hey, the color, man. Black people. Sure. I tell you, we will go through a lot <laughs> anyways. When Esther was black and broke, but then she got established. She so got money. Case, oh, she got money. Money hey, and she should not leave that out. So now she's established. Yes. Who can come to her table? Okay, generally, uh, she's open to any person. Uh -huh. Yeah depending with exactly the key selling point that uh, she needs from the yeah. guy. Mm -hmm. So you as a guy, you have to prepare well. You know exactly what are you going to add on her life. Mm -hmm. Already she has established. So you need, there's a lot that she needs. That's why she's looking for a guy. Mm -hmm. So it is just an open field, but mm -hmm. also for the open-minded people. Yeah. Yes. When you look at it, uh, Jeff, for... I don't know how you guys, your relationships are, but you guys are still students. I don't, do students date? You can tell me, yeah, at the comment section. But I, I don't know your experiences, but you can uh, try to paint from your picture. If you were to join a chick who is already established, I'm using chick coded language, please, this is TV. Yeah, a lady who's already established and you want to be her boyfriend and she has everything. She has the car, in fact, a first class because she has car, one of the latest of, you know, the rims in town. She has a good job. She has savings. Like, she's, she's an already full-blown package. And then here you are. You're a university student. You want to join her. So what will you be giving her? Because there's somebody here who said, I don't know. This is a tough situation for men. Right. <laughs> uh, the dame is already established and has everything she wants. Uh -huh. So, like, this, uh, this woman... Uh, most of them tend to be specific in the type of man they want. Right. For example, what I've learned is that a woman might, live, might love you not because of what you have, but what you offer. So right. she'll be very sharp upstairs in what you are offering to the woman. Maybe mm -hmm. that can change the way it thinks towards the men. Yeah. Yeah. For example, let me just use this uh, slang a bit. Some women might love you because of what you offer, e.g. gemiako. Mm. Yeah, mm. you might be very poor and broke and black, as Enoch said. <laughs> <laughs> but what you are offering on the table is something that is yeah. very nice. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's right. my take on that. But before it escalates to even, when you, like you mentioned the game, but I'm sure there's a process. Ama, you just meet and then now it's all the game happening. I believe it's a process, but like you said, yeah, magic usually happens. You can meet... Uh, but I'll also pose to you, is it possible yes. to just meet someone today and, like you said, everything is happening, the whole shebang is going down? Okay, to my take, it depends yeah. with uh -huh. the kind of a lady, how the lady is well prepared. Uh, yeah. Recently, I had the same topic, discussing yeah. with fellow ladies, mm -hmm. and uh, they are not the same. So, there is uh, that lady who can fall in love on the first day, and there is that lady who plays hard to get. Mm. So the two, they have differences. You as a guy, you have to play smart. You'll yeah. be ready like, you know, 
this lady nikimuita kwangu akuje kwangu i'll do this and this and make yeah, sure that nimesha capture mm -hmm. and uh, there's another lady who will not show up in my house but will yeah. give a uh, maybe will propose to have a meet up somewhere else yeah and from there ataku gauge ataku gauge until the moment atakupatia go ahead it is mm -hmm. over a month yeah yeah so it depends with the kind of a lady mm. yeah but also when you look at today's world of dating everything is happening very fast on social media we yes. have so many dating apps that yes. somebody joins today like if you join right now <coughs> definitely by midday you'll be having someone sure if, if if you're into it or if you're all about that life yeah and you look at some of the things that people are going through but then stories now sponsors because i believe at this point this lady or this chick like you've said is already an established person yes what is does she want anyways uh, like you've said so possibly let's let's try to just break it down such a lady and is a because she has the money she has the house she has the car like you said she was black yes. and broke but now she's i'm all shady rangi kila kitu like she's a fine package yes. right and and complete so ana za kona tafuta nini from the comments right here somebody said ni attention to na affection uh -huh. mm, what else could she be wanting okay uh there's a lot that uh, that lady uh, needs on her end that's why she's giving a room for for that one you as a guy you should be willing to handle that lady Remember she's a, she's already established established lady she's Esther So uh I as Enoch coming to he, to her life I should know how to handle her there's a lot of things uh that I should prepare myself first mm -hmm. this lady she's running businesses am I an intellectual person am I creative that whenever we sit together we can come up uh, we can come into a conclusion where we are pushing a business together we are coming to uh, an agreement of something good you should be a person or a guy who understands so let me say anajirusha tu kila sa remember this is a lady who uh, she is going for big uh, conversation meetings na kila kitu in the mid middle of the night and i receive a call going to dubai for a meeting where you you're not understanding guy uko hapo like very very confused na danda na kupatia na kitu fulani uko nje you're not getting the attention so you have to prepare yourself yeah. the first thing you have to be like accept yourself and have mm. the willingness of handling such kind of a lady mm. yes and uh not only that mm -hmm. you must be a respectful uh, man mm. you have to respect that lady you yeah. know uh let us take it in this perspective like uko na gari uko na viet safi you can go anywhere you want but mm -hmm. without without this lady coming into your life you feel like you are incomplete so mm -hmm. kuna kitu yenyu lady anaenda ku add up si si lazima iko game ama nini but mm -hmm. uh, and i feel like there is that kind of love that i need to get from a guy a lady maybe yeah. if I, it was a guy mm -hmm. yeah so you are there to show up to show exactly what she needs mm -hmm. as a guy uh, Jeff you mentioned a, a point and I was um, I was trying to build it up, build it up in my mind. I believe it can be very intimidatory or rather intimidating for a man who is joining a lady who's already established and you have nothing because as a man naturally you, you are expected to have it together, have the money, the cars, the house, even the look definitely have to sound and look the part. So if you're going into the life of this already established lady, you'll be a weakling because at this point you have nothing to offer like you said she's talking about ceos uh, she's talking about work and networks and international travel and then well but toka tropo kisi umetulia hapo na lofas i'm pretty sure you will feel some type of way if you are in her presence because also let's imagine you're in the house she has provided everything she's bought the washing machine the cooker <coughs> like fully furnished house kila kitu ni ame buy so you're just there as a child do you mean you're just a doll i mean there's this question i had somebody ask what kind of man are you who can't you know I, I believe that's the kind of question she could be asking if she's the kind of lady who's wanting you to compensate because at this point it's intimidating do you hold the same opinion mm, not really mm -hmm. according to the research done by forbes in 2019 mm -hmm. 85 85% of the women see men unattractive or they see men <laughs> unattractive unattractive 85% of the women so uh -huh. for a because of lack of something yeah lack of something maybe the financial constraints uh -huh. maybe the men uh, uh, 
sura pia ijajipa vile so 25% oh, of them see them unattractive so mm. if you in this uh, perspective we see an alpha uh, an alpha female this is a female who does everything in the relationship yeah. and uh, you as a man you, you you also have to contribute despite of the fact that this alpha female does everything you also have to contribute for example for the tiny is for example uh, you, ca you can you can split the some of the cause financial cause you can uh, maybe encourage her emotionally it love does not only entail on uh, maybe financial stability this yeah. type of women most of them are uh, s most of them are single i realize that most of the broke women are the, are the ones that really look into money mm -hmm. as i can say most of these uh, rich and uh, established women look just for love maybe kind of attention if you can show them that then you are good to go yeah. i'm not saying if you enter into such a relationship you'll be the better male but if you just you agree you agree on what uh, how your relationship will go on uh, including the splitting of the financial uh, cause and uh, yeah i think you'll be good to go from there Mm. I'm trying to look at it. You have nothing to offer. You're jobless. Or let's just say life is going to sour. And so you don't have much resources. But the vibe is a vibe. Like yeah. you guys have connected and it's lit. So how do you, how do you prevent yourself from feeling? Personally, I'd feel intimidated. I didn't want to give my own personal sentiments. But yeah, it's intimidating to be in a relationship with someone who's doing everything for you. Like how do you sleep at night? I can't even blink twice for me. I'd rather be single. <laughs> okay. But can I say something? Yeah. Uh, as, I, as, I, as I was the beginning, I, mm -hmm. I said about accepting who you are first. Oh, you, so you'll accept your situation? You have to accept your situation. Ha, Remember, how? you're handling someone who is stable. Yeah. Yeah. She's even driving. Where would I driving license? Tough time to make drive. No. Mm -hmm. So, so in, the, in the aspect, yeah? <laughs> yeah. You as a guy, you have, uh -huh. you have to be accountable uh -huh. whenever you're in that relationship. Uh -huh. You should know that, okay, uh, more than she's uh, stable, I need mm -hmm. also to, be, to bring something on the table. At the end of the month, so if I can let a million, uh -huh. I have uh, something else to bring. Remember, like that exactly? develops with, uh, <laughs> that comes with the self-accepting, uh -huh. okay, being uh, or maintaining self-independency. Mm -hmm. whereby i have my personal goals yeah. this lady mm -hmm. anakupenda sit akupendi and mm -hmm. she's willing to support you oh this is different this is a different case she's yes. willing to support yes uh, i'm talking of you are the one vibing and the vibe is vibing but if you to your part what do you have haiko achana na she's willing okay unajua she's willing is a different story then you have to she's be smart willing is a different story you have to be smart cuz utamwambia nini she's seen everything she has everything yes yeah but uh, on the other end, mm -hmm. also this lady loves, uh, I think she will go with a smart lady, uh, a, a smart guy. You, mm -hmm. Because you are good yeah. in vibe, you have good energy. Mm -hmm. On the other end, oh, you energy. must be creative. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have to tell me, uh, Wakati, we are having discussion about my businesses. You are there yeah. to tell me like, hey, uh, babe, do you know that uh, we can do this and this? And yeah. it, it will be so profitable whenever mm. we focus as a family, yeah? yeah? And she's there to support you. Yeah, no, no, and a wezo. Where are you wezo? You are there to bring idea. But how do you feel, though? I okay, hate, the, the hate it. The aspect is, we I African men, it. okay, yeah. let me bring it in that as uh, in ha, perspective. We African men. That, uh, <laughs> that you, have, you have to take control of everything. Not take okay. control, but you know, a man is a man. Either of way, course, with control you, or without. You have to feel superior. You are the voice. The Bible says you are the head. She is... The, the neck or something. But from that tail. perspective, remember also, <laughs> you, you, you must play low. Hakuna kucheza chini, baba. Lazima tu, because I believe, I can only imagine my dad like just sitting and then my mom, uh, uh, the math can't math. Okay, okay. That's why I'm, I was telling you, it's very intimidating. Like you just seated and then she's furnishing and do my friend, utachomo na maji moto tena sana. But sasa hapa, uh -huh. atuangali in a perspective that you are a lazy guy. Yeah. Remember, you are going for a, a stable lady. Yeah. So you you know you are not going to be an indep uh, depending depending on her in everything. The mm. first thing is, at a, the first date akikuja anakutana na wewe, mm. she's she's going to gauge you first. Anajua mm. 
huyu jamaa nikimchukua my business will my business run yeah ama yeye atakuwa tu hapo like of, mm. of course atakupatia that platform of you feeling as a man in that relationship but mm. also you have to play your your cards well mm. yeah okay there's somebody mentioned stories are alpha male and beta male so i don't know let me let me let me throw that to you jeff uh, how would you feel you have let me throw it back again to you because you had already given some few sentiments how do you feel you are in this relationship and there's nothing you're bringing on the table akuna in, in nothing bringing on the table meaning she has everything if you want to travel she's the one paying i mean you can't even afford her kind of travel maybe for her she travels first class business whatever yeah or even private jet yeah kitaka kwenda diani she doesn't need to use the normal flights book private jet she pays for it and it's nothing so okay kujapo ivo as in what is what are you talking unaweza mwambie kitu kama ni because i believe this kind of chick is almost like a super woman she has every experience of life literally literally okay uh, on the financial aspect you can, uh, as you can see you cannot support this woman in any financial aspect but we have some aspects such as the emotional one so we should not base on our argument only on the financial aspect as a man i'm entering this relationship knowing that i cannot offer anything financially but i can offer there are some crippled. issues yeah financially disabled <laughs> I'm financially disabled but there are some aspect yeah. which i can contribute in for example uh-huh. the emotional aspect yeah. this is a lady he needs a man who can pamper her he needs a man who can uh, tell how cute she is he needs a man who akishatoka job ako na pale anaweza lean on aonge so it's not yeah. all about the financial aspect where, where you, you are crippled and always always this idea kabisa there are some mm-hmm. aspects such as that the emotional aspect maybe giving advice on the business ideas ju vile eno kamesema this is somebody who is working is meeting big big people so you, what you can do is just offer your advice at kama ni kidogo just try and act a man should be a man you should just devise some ways to ubakie na hiyo jina being a man hata kama in the financial aspect you cannot we have some various way you should be quick to to maneuver in such situations for you let me throw it to you individually if you are in such a situation creatively because you amesema eno kamesema be creative yeah. i'm really thinking in creativity <clears throat> so for you what is the creativity that you're going to give her <laughs> I'm trying to just picture it. Let's imagine it's happening it's in real life right now. You you saying you're going to be creative. How so? Hmm. In this case this woman has nothing to lose. <laughs> this woman has nothing to lose. Mm-hmm. So like in the terms of being creative mostly I can say I can offer support not financially. I can offer support moral support advice I can offer emotional support. Emotional support ni nini? Umesema mara kata tu. Emotional support. So unajua them ni them. Ako na emotions zake. Speak on emotions ama zako is for emotions. But in this aspect I cannot offer anything financially. Yeah. So maybe I can turn to emotionally. It's yeah. not all about those things mnafikiria. <laughs> Right. but at a, the way you treat a girl mm. the way you treat a girl mhm ude makona kila kitu always enda uende maybe kwa gari uende kwa car shop umilie gari the little things matter in a relationship yeah hata ukimwambia baby you look smart amezoea kusikia hizo vitu let me give you, but it comes let, from let, somebody let me give you an example last week i spoke to there's a friend of mine who's famous a lady so i can remember the reason why she's single and she doesn't respond to her dms she's tired of people telling her she's beautiful she's a star so she's seen everything she has everything unaweza mwambia nini sasa as a man and i was like my dear do you want to go six feet under man solo <laughs> you have to hop on someone and she's like now who am i hopping on to she needs someone who matches her her value and her worth just like you know my my co-host Seal gonna say ma, they need another established person i don't know if you saw that before yes, we went on a yes. break so it just shows it's difficult for a disabled man either financially or any other parts of your or facet of your life if it's disabled then i believe you should just look for someone who like matches they say identify yourself with a tribe that looks like you i don't know if that but i know i'll sound off on that one 
Do you believe you should identify yourself with a tribe that looks like you? No, no, no. Because you should on the go other end, off the grain? I, I should go even over, like, uh, yeah. ideally, uh, ideally, I should not focus on something that gives me the, uh, the uh, is it, imenifunga? Mm -hmm. Yeah? I should, f like, think outside the box. See, okay, sir, I'm a guy, I don't have money, I should look for a lady who is lower than me so that I can also support. I look as a guy, like, nikwe a man in that relationship. No. We have yeah. stable ladies who also, personally, I can, maybe through my supportive attitude that I'll be giving them, it will be a yeah. perfect way for them to accept me. Yeah. So I should not uh, give myself uh, at an end to something that is, is bigger. It's like a dream. Yeah. Uh, I'm from Migori. So the yeah. only place that I can think or the university I can just join is Kisi University. Mm. And there's the University of Nairobi. No. Yeah. I have that opportunity oh, to go at the University of Nairobi. This Harvard. <laughs> so that's how now I push myself. Mara that is an idea. Yes, Nikujijaza. Okay. Uh, there's something in Yalisema. Uh, mm -hmm. How we are supporting, how will you support uh, such kind of a lady? Yeah. Emotionally and uh, everything. On my end, I feel like uh, this lady... Uh, on, on, on the way we are going to support or I'm going to support her for her mm. to fail me is uh, she's a successful lady. Yeah. The first thing I should uh, celebrate her success every time. Mm. Maybe Hannah msewa mwenye kikuja kwa nyumba amewa babe, I made a million this month as a yeah. profit. Mm. I'll be there celebrating like yeah, we've made it together even though ataka ukwa. Yeah. You see? So right. there's a lot uh, that we, we, that lady needs yes. from you. So I don't have to put myself you have to of don't have yeah. There's yes. a comment here that says Kurama Dem wako established now patangi mtu. Definitely they can settle for anyone. I don't know. Uh, is that now an opportunity for someone who is disabled <laughs> 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 to jump in? Because if Esther is established and he needs another established person because yeah, alasema Kurama Dem wako established now patangi mtu so they can settle for anything. Uh, is it that is that an opportunity for anyone now to jump in to, with emotional support? Because even me too, if mm -hmm. I'm already an established guy, mm -hmm. and uh, should I do I need to go for somebody who's struggling so that I rasmatize them up, or I should go for somebody who's stable like me? I think it's it's a, also a two-way traffic. Yes. Uh, what do you think about that? I think it's uh, maybe, maybe not. Mm -hmm. As I said, this woman has nothing to lose. And most of these uh, women have uh, specifics on the, on the type of men they want. Yeah. Yeah, maybe at the time, yeah. at the love, the affection, from the comment session. Maybe at the we'll just see her not as a financial provider. You know, sasa, most of uh, we men, in those relationships, we can as if we are beggars, to men that are financially equipped. So yeah. maybe this lady will need a man who yeah. will prove to her that she's not a financial provider to the man. Yeah. Yeah, the man should also act smart in a such a... kitu ya kufanya a lady to, to love you without money. That's just mm -hmm. a fixed a fixed opinion most of us have that yeah. uh, broke bed cannot date yeah. expensive women. Okay. Yeah. I think that should be a debate also in high school. Uh, the debates are like, a president is better than a doctor, a, doctor. a pastor is better than, you know, similar. I, I have an example. <laughs> Please, I have an example. Uh, recently, I saw on the Nairobi Gossip, yeah. there's a certain screenshot uh, where a lady just shared to Nairobi Gossip about mm. her relationship. She's an mm. established lady. Yeah. And uh, now the text was herself with the hubby, yeah. the, the, the boyfriend. So mm -hmm. the conversation was, the guy was reaching out to her in the yeah. morning. In mm -hmm. fact, the whole night, the lady was at work on her job, mm -hmm. doing her job. He's the one providing everything. Uh -huh. So in the morning, the guy texted him, right. calling, uh, calling the relationship to, like, she's saying that she want, he, he wants to step down, to end the relationship. The reason why is that mm -hmm. uh, the lady is so focused is mm -hmm. so intelligent, wise. That is what the guy was giving as a reason mm -hmm. on the other end. Mm -hmm. uh, 
but the perspective of the lady and how the lady responded was uh, personally I really appreciate that lady for that uh, response because what she said is uh, remember if I was the guy Enoch uh, every everything that I'm doing even the night shift that uh, I usually got for the job it is mm. for maintaining our family yeah. uh, maintaining our relationship mm. I provide to you everything so t you texting me now like uh, you demand the end of this relationship it does it give me an end of my life yeah. i'll continue in fact from, from i was to come back to home but i'll not come uh, i'll not come back i yeah. I'm, I'm just going to schedule my my timetable and move uh, to a different business that i'm running yeah. and make sure that i want to to grow as an independent lady so mm -hmm. you're not there to stand or to defend the success that i have as a lady yeah, mm -hmm. yeah? So, and they call off the relationship and it mm -hmm. ended uh, it ended. Also, yeah, it okay. ended, and I'm very, very proud for that lady. Mm -hmm. Personally, as an individual, as a guy, I'm very proud of that lady because uh, you don't have to, you don't have to to have someone who can limit your success. Okay. You are there to have big dreams. Mm -hmm. uh, let that relationship. Let me talk to the audience. Let <laughs> that relationship okay. stops you to get what you want or the success you want. Yeah, yeah. focus on your success first. Everything mm. will just come by its own. Itakuja. At your day, when I make it in life, yeah. I'll make sure that I may make it. And then I may focus happy yeah. to have someone now. But why can't uh, you as a man as well focus, get established, and then come back? Okay, it takes process. But remember, yeah. we need them when you maybe I'm in Okay. Uh, okay. Nimepitia, nime, nimepitia Nairobi Gossip Leo. Wali kwa na tag some ladies when you nataka gents. Sayo, uh -huh. kianda tu pitia uko status. Yeah. Iti, but okay, then I'm looking for a yeah, sorry, yeah, like yeah, three yeah. ladies, I guess. Mm. Yeah, three to four. Mm. At the, already, uh, I can't maintain myself, I just need a man. I try mm. to kuingia kwa one of their profile. They are well stable. Vizuri, yeah. wakosawa. So it corresponds with this comment. There's ladies who are established, but they are desperate for a man. Yeah. Desperate is a very strong word. But anyways, just say you need you need someone for someone. companionship. But yeah. also, what is preventing this chick mm -hmm. from getting her dream man? Like like you said, ladies are very specific on the kind of dude they want. Wanataka mwenyakona sauti mzito, mwenyakona six packs, mwenyakona gari, mwenyani mrefu. Like there's so many things they want in there. But at the end of the day, when they've experienced all those, they put them aside and they go to church to pray for deliverance. You wonder like what's ha what's not happening. So is it, does some of these things matter? Height, CG looks, CG pesa, nini, six packs out in Zito. You know, Bonatus and M to create the person from scratch, more established, but more than that. I've, I've seen success stories. Most of our fathers, actually, they picked up from scratch. Like yes. they started in high school when they had nothing. And then they got established together even with the kids. But right now, in this day and age, you want somebody who's already up there. And you can't even match. The energy is not matching. Even the mindset, even the conversations you have yeah. cannot even match this person because of the experience why why can't people start from scratch jeff i think some of these specifications really matter mm -hmm. yeah you should add jokes there we have some ladies for example uh, we have some ladies who want a man who is a uh, smarty mm -hmm. a man who is smartly dressed unaweza kuwa una kitu kwa mfuko but unaua luku Ama oh. you are a very jokey man so you are like engage so you are kill to even yeah, yeah okay. you no know, <laughs> For, uh, from the few ladies I've interacted with, when I say to, hey, I'm going to be a boy, maybe I'm going to be jokes. So I'm going to be a jokes, I'm going to be a Nah. So like some of these uh, few <laughs> okay. things really so matter to a lady. So you're going to be a little bit of a fit, you're going to be a little bit of a fit. But in uh, sectors like this, mm. like you have a vibe now with them in everything. Maybe yeah. ni in that uh, the financial aspect only, no, mm. but in some sectors, for example, maybe you say me, kuna six packs, mm. kuna, I don't know if six packs really matter. <laughs> <laughs> kuna height, height, there's an obsession with the height, your hashtag, tall, dark, and what, Black. handsome. <laughs> or tall, dark, and what? And so handsome, 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 handsome. Tall, dark, and handsome. Black, black there's that obsession, I don't know. Why, what is it with that TDH thing? Oh, why are you smiling? <laughs> You're almost Cause, giggling. Cause, yeah, he, <laughs> oh, because you, told, uh, oh, you've seen yourself <laughs> in that hashtag. Sure, like. Oh, you, you've been told before? 
not really. How did you process it? Definitely, yeah. if, if you're <laughs> running away from it, definitely. But anyways, there's that obsession with it. Does it really matter, height and the rest of the co skin color complexion? Mm -hmm. But I've seen ladies who prefer light-skinned men, mm -hmm. but then there's also a whole Pandora's box about light-skinned men, yeah. Yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. oh, okay, on my end, yeah, yeah, some of them usually prefer. Do you consider yourself light-skinned? Yes. You consider yourself a light-skinned dude? Uh, the way they take it, because on the <laughs> other end, I'll just brag like I'm a light skin, and then yeah. Utapata, a certain lady doesn't like. Does it come with advantages, being light yeah, skin? Yeah, yeah, Like sure. what exactly? Uh, the first thing is, whenever you are giving out your pickup uh, pick lines, okay. and that lady would be, okay, uh, you know, one of the ideal features that I'm looking for a guy, I need a chocolate lady, uh, guy, and this mm. guy is exactly the person. Let me ah, just listen to okay. other things back. Mini Shampatia, go ahead. Oh, you are wrong to be careful. Very, very easy. Yeah, okay. appearance. Okay. But okay. on the other okay. end, let, let me say. Uh, <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, yeah. kuna e perspective here to have uh, previous uh, prefer preferences. Yeah? yeah. Which on my end, I don't support it uh, yeah. in terms of relationship. Because yeah. uh, what Rajulizanga like me as Enoch, I usually look for a lady who uh, an okay, akona these kind of characters. But in my life. And my roadmap, I never si kutanangi na na kutananga na wengine. You see? So, <laughs> <laughs> wengine ni kwa wengine like <laughs> others. Two, yeah, yeah, others. Two, two weeks we are done. Trying. Like you see? Yeah. So the aspect. So what now, makes it two weeks we are done? Because you know, there should be factors contributing. Oh, yeah, because, because I don't just believe you're meeting a person and you're like, no, thank you. <laughs> I'm sure there's something you've looked and you're like, wow. The aspect here yeah. is no. she's not driving your energy. Like mm -hmm. there's something. Remember, you have uh, your preferences. You, okay. you know exactly what you want. But, mm -hmm. uh, the kind of ladies that I'm meeting, see wale when you have Kiria or Harvard. Yeah. You see? But it's your, but energy, Aldo, Aldo it's your energy attracting those people. Because, uh, because I, believe, I, believe, I'm not the I problem. believe you are who you are and you attract exactly who you are. No. So you can't attract Rihanna yeah, and so Beyonce. You, want to, you, want to tell you me can't like attract a... Rihanna and Beyonce and you're in Barambamba. Uh -uh. You can't. <laughs> You can't, I swear to God, you can't. But because when uh, you look at what your energy and your environment and your, what, you, what you are, literally, mm -hmm. it's bringing the people who are your vibration. So you, uh, but I believe we can work on it. Uh -oh. I'm not disparaging. <laughs> we can work on yeah. it. But like you said, yeah, there's a brighter future ahead. Yeah, so, yeah. okay. Uh, uh, on, the, on the roadmap, you uh -huh. find that I meet some people who doesn't fulfill exactly what I want. Mm. But I'm there to have them closer to me. Maybe Give it they're time. providing love. Give it time then. Uh, okay, for you to maintain to be a patient guy, yeah. we are youths. Eh? Mm -hmm. We are youths, so we oh, have patience. patience. A patience, Nikitwingine, we are so weak on that, but uh, oh, okay. we need to work on that. No, no, she did Gen Z, Sasa. Dawa. <laughs> they say Gen Z's don't want to trust the process. They want the process to trust them, them. which exactly. is difficult. But uh, that's a good conversation for another time. But also, bro, when you look at it, for you, when you get established, let's believe when Michelle took a campus, you've bravo, go out here, you're killing it. You have everything you've ever dreamt of. You're now done. You're done with the BS of messing around as, as a man, right? You want to settle. Are you settling for somebody who has problems? Ama, you want peace? The answer is obvious. I can't settle for a lady who is problematic. I want an, an understanding lady, a well-established lady as I am. Now look the way the <laughs> scales are changing. They are changing very fast. <laughs> I want a lady yeah. who is reasoning. Mm -hmm. so Not like a philosopher, I'm a motivation speaker. <laughs> <laughs> like, I want to balance the scales. Mm. I want somebody who is a... In so fact, revenge, okay? <laughs> <laughs> not really. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want someone who will love me, not because of what I, want, I have. Yeah. Just like Kichagua, uh, people who are, as a man, not for the, for the women's side, who Kichagua, Madam Kiambao is maybe, Chini Kabisa, at a corner a bank, at a corner kama equity. So on somebody who is a uh, energy too much, come on a job, Nimsi energy too much. I don't want to too much. Kukosha vyombo kwa ingine amangu. Because I believe if you have bra, let, let, let's picture. Let's try to create a, a, a figure of a man. Let's say somebody like Caliph Cairo is a good friend of mine. He was yeah. once here at some point. Uh, you know him and Ozamagari Kwenze. 
And uh, the way his relationships are already out there, the way, you know, the chain is really chaining. Yes. But also when you look at the ladies, like there's a certain X factor in this Chiles that she, he's dating. But on a certain level of beauty, certain level of brain, a certain level of stability, and just the aura that these women are bringing on the table. It's really conspicuous and interesting. So, Pierre, Ukiangalio, Kav, Utenda, really, Mtumunye, Umesemotato, Mtu, Shago, and then Ukuja Moshe, Akwe, Malisafi, what if Akutoke, Akshak, established Pierre? Because if we've seen those stories, I don't know if you heard of this story, there was someone, Ali, Somesha Dem High School, I come so mesha kenda uni after dem ame graduate aka said maskutaki tena nimepata mtu mwenye ni type yangu i don't know if you've heard of that what's the question uh, would you would you do that as i said i won't take a lady who is a i don't want to use the word below average <laughs> at least she has something to offer like lady yeah. anafikiria yeah. lady yeah. Hata kama ana, kuna vile anaunyesha hata anataka kuwa nayo. So I, I, I just can't go and pick someone who is a, a mekatu wapo, ajui kitu cha kufanya, like, itakuwa sama, atakuwa na nion like, I'm the main financial provider. So when you baba aki, <laughs> when you daddy work. <laughs> Because in, in, in this day and age, Pierre, the things are happening. You know, people want zaddies and mummies, yeah. be papichulos and the rest. But what happened to just like, you know, uh, let's start from scratch. Yes. You know? Because I believe that's also a journey. Like you get to journey <coughs> with someone through life and get to know them. Uh, I don't know. I think, was it, is it Snoop Dogg? There's one of the rappers who married somebody from high. Yeah, Snoop Dogg. Yeah. A wife working from high school. Like scratch, yeah. children working out to eat. And they've grown up all together. So who them is he feel threatened? Uh, um, like you are extremely successful. Mm -hmm. I'm okay. That through laws, then yeah, the other one has financial issues. The yeah. other one has to come in. When I want to say it's a balanced, nini, it's a balanced scale. Okay. As compared to Vilomesema, you just picked up somebody from the interiors of Huisero. Huisero is a good place, by the way. Or uh, Migori, Kulendan, and then when I was at Nairobi. First yeah. of all, they're just amazed by the way what? you're driving the car yes. and everything. Yeah. So it will take you time to even walk through. I can imagine you teaching this person. Like, I, I think it's intense. I don't know what you think about that. Okay. My point is, uh, starting with someone from scratches, uh, mm -hmm. at this level, as a Gen Z, let me talk it uh, in a, a Gen Z aspect. Mm -hmm. uh, it brings insecurities like you become insecure. I'm uh, going to develop you as a lady, okay. but on the other end, mm -hmm. so I'm driving a demo <laughs> and coming here, utakuta, utakuna na wase wana drive Mercedes Benz. Yeah. So on the other end, I'm going to face a big competition. And uh, mm -hmm. usually they say money washes, ina ku change, ina ku change, yeah? I have that money. You make you provide everything. You become a beautiful, gorgeous lady outside here in Nairobi now. Yeah. That's where now you are in her inbox in Akua, a bigger audience like Kila Mtu I remember, kuna wenye ni better than me when you reach out. So you find that uh, that's where I'll be losing. I feel insecure. Personally, yeah. I'll not go with that lady. Okay, we can't, we can't just develop together. Mm. Yeah, we can't. What I, I need is, from scratch. if uh, I'm that kind of a guy I've established, mm -hmm. I'll just go for a reasonable lady, mm. even though she's not uh, established, but we, we, can, we can align together. Yeah, we can sail together, like we can think of something. She's ambitious. Yeah? Yeah. That kind of a lady, yeah, I can support you together. As long as unafikiria vizuri, you don't have that money, I'm there to support you. As long as you give me love. My lecturer uh, recently told, told us in class that uh, she was advising ladies, Akawambi Aje, you ladies don't think that that one thing, it is the only thing that can bring, you can bring to the kwa table, as in, you know, you to and as a letter kwa table, that you maintain that guy. No. The same yeah. thing, the guy can get it outside here. He will mm. maintain to only you. So you should think yeah. outside the box, like you be above. Yeah. Uh, let a kitabu, let a uh, <coughs> be a be a professor, let a PhD kwa table. Nani ambia yeah. enok, you have a degree even though you are stabilized, but mm. I'm here to prove you that also I'm an intellect. Yeah, yeah, I've studied. Mm. No, no, such kind of a lady. But uh, in this aspect of growing with someone kutoka scratches, mm. hey, maybe me God basi to make to work 
I don't <laughs> think personally I can. It's I can destiny. It's that. destiny. It's a destiny, maybe. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, when you look at it, the aspect here, yeah, an independent lady who has everything she wants. Uh, also, working class. Kuna kwa ngana hiyo aspect, ama hiyo notion that in most working class ladies, how nangam to, they are desperate. Ata umesema tu wapa shortly, that they are single and they're just always searching. But then uh, what happened then? Because if then women are now working and being independent and doing as twice as what men can do, mm -hmm. then it's bringing out that alpha male-ish, you know, uh, demeanor. Yes. So it intimidates men and they tend to, you know, like hold themselves back from even approaching. Because already the car she's driving is a f masculine car. Yeah. She has the latest brand of G-Wagon. That's a super masculine car. Robust. But you know, she has it and she's single. So, okay, Mangalevi, uh, how do you even blink? <laughs> yeah, most of these ladies are <laughs> single. For example, let, let me use uh, my example. Or, uh, example, mm -hmm. most of these uh, rich kids, uh, ladies who are single, you. Okay, let me use my class, the architecture class. Yeah. So like 90% of, uh, of them ni mabolas. Watch our wademio vila mesema. Bola, wale, dad is driving a defender. Yeah. Mama's a private jet. So like most of them are single, we, we men fear to, to approach. Like, yeah. unawana, eh, hey, adi ni kikatia udem, ni tapeleka wapi. Ni tapeleka yeah. detu wapi. What yeah. rings in your mind? You are too. Peleke dem aboretam chi. When the photo shoot, na ice cream. The, photo shoot. <laughs> the other thing is that <laughs> most of we think that these yeah. men, these women have a uh -huh. wakuna watu tayari. You are the way in uh, yeah. Ukiona dem and a drive nini? You'll see. What will ring in your mind is that akona mse ana. So that's what makes most of them to to remain single. Mm. Yeah. But kuna success stories. Uh, I've heard the story of uh, a very close friend who. It is a very rich, rich lady from Karen. Kule Kunetwaje, there's a place in Karen, there's one of the estates, Naskia Ukondo Koje, the cream de la cream of Mula on Atoka. And, this, and this, <laughs> this chick took this guy, and they're still together, they're sailing really hard. And I'll cook one of your story, like, oh, where we you doing MQC? Oh, you where we you doing Saudi? Oh, you doing Six Packs? Like, it was just vibes on vibes, and inshallah. So, in short, in, in as much as we are despising, you know, saying, you know, too much established ladies demand a lot, but there's success stories as well. Yes. Uh, on my end, mm -hmm. I feel like, as men, we should maintain the aspect of being man. Like, Onyesha, your manhood, you don't have to see this lady driving, and then you're silent that you cannot approach him, or, or you, can, uh, you cannot approach her. Just no. approach, shoot your shot, you never know. Mm. You never Kilimani, Karen, you never, Runda, you never know. So... Uh, like maintain your uh, your man, your, you, you as a man, like you maintain it. Talk, speak. Russia uh, vibe ni ukonayo. Kuna ule jama, kuna that lady mwenyako kilimani anapenda kienyeji boy. Yeah. Na uko hapo. So uh -huh. kiangalia that tickiness of you. Uyo kienyeji boy kit. sasa pia, unajua tulapenda kuchampu wa madem sana. Yes, Uyo ni kienyeji, uyu si juni aji, uyu ni high class. <laughs> kienyeji man ni a, a, a man like what, you know? Who is this kind of Kenyaji man? Ah, okay. One, some th th there's someone who told me that I'm a Kenyaji. I think oh. according to <coughs> how you used to carry myself, the vibes, yeah, the vibes, and the conversation. because in a slap. Oh, I so get like, it. Uh, and then <laughs> I love the fact that you accepted it very yeah, fast. Yeah, yeah. And I was working towards it. <laughs> and you're not it. offended. <laughs> <laughs> very, okay. very happy man. Uh -huh. So, uh, and she was a lady, by the way. Yeah. So when I she took on a vibe, a Kenyaji. <laughs> <laughs> Obvious, Miki, my name is Lakuja Kenyeji. You have Kuku Kenyeji, and that is the only meat that slaps well than. Mm, I see. <laughs> so I know what she was talking. Be positive. Yeah. Be positive, ever and ever. So, yeah. uh, the, how you carry yourself as a guy, mm. uh, it explains or give a definition of Kenyeji to that lady. And uh, it depends. Uh, yeah. Okay, I don't like men who usually talk, a sanguine in that uh, personality. Personality. Yeah. But well, I'm a presenter. <laughs> <laughs> you see? Right. But there's that lady when you this is an established guy. Like, who yeah. can talk to people. I love mm -hmm. that kind of a guy. Yeah. So, it, we have different definitions. I can't, I can't tell. Yeah. Me, I'm because I should fly, but 
<laughs> nice owning up owning yeah. up real, real dudes owning up but also ushaske dem akisema spendangi chaliana akili mbona unashanga alimfanya nini hadi akasema huyu ananga akili sijui kama ushaske watu kikosana ndio sema wewe unanga akili you know martusi zina fly to in the air left right and center na zote ni ma bullets <laughs> so huyu chaliana za kwa amefanya nini hadi akambiwa akispendangi mtu ananga akili unasikia stake mtu ana akili You wonder kwani uh, ni mwandazimu nini? <laughs> okay, this depends on the type of conversation you have with this woman. Uh-huh. Maybe part of this woman is a woman who needs advice. I love wewe kitu. Okay. Me <laughs> for example mnaongelea about maybe economic status of the relationship. Kinywe kitu kwa akili yako ni ndani unaongea tu jaba. Kitambee this idea relationship. Huyu atakuwa na you are not straight for one anga kill. Ya unaongea tu jaba oh like you don't know anything about economy like yeah. ama any other topic you, you, like you can't contribute as a man or you are a man has a say in a relationship this how you keep up time they <laughs> make any topic you discuss or oh, by the way what will we do in this day uko yeah. uko uko to you don't give any suggestion you want the 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 the, 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 fee, the female to take charge ya kila kitu that is where yeah. we get it wrong as men hapo yeah. nakuona eh kusema kweli huyu 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 jamaa ana akili <laughs> But yeah, it depends on uh, how you react to some of the conversations that yeah. you have in a relationship that makes a woman say that yeah au fikiri. But I believe that I believe that because I also 90% of the time is how you guys exchange yeah. your so, talks yeah. For example, yes. mbeko sana unajua usually wakati mbeko sana ama umemiachana that's why unajua other explanation about definition about you. When in yeah. jinga una kili <laughs> player <laughs> like hizo definitions zote. <laughs> But just Rewind rudi kwa relationship during the, your best moments. You are unaona ile best moments that yeah. that was you. Achana na hiki kitu anasema. It's nile kutoa tu anger. So mimi akiniambia hauna akili, mimi najua niko na akili cuz tuko tuna sell pamoja. Sasa sina mtu na wote. Hata sijui nilikupendea nini. Eh, nilikupendea bro. Azi tumepiga on two months yote wewe ulikuwa na kaa wapi? Ah, I can only imagine now for sasa yeah. ikifika hiyo level you guys you definitely have to go a separate ways. But also do you believe um in a relationship mm-hmm. in as Africa to a place that you guys are not just meant for each other. You've had what you've had mm-hmm. and it's now time for you to say goodbye. In as much as you guys were jo- Romeo and Juliet, but now at this point mm-mm. it is a different. I- I- yeah, sure. It is It's possible for love to die. Mm-hmm. And you guys will go possible. a separate ways. Uh, not even sep- uh, going in a separate ways, but uh-huh. just uh, like diverting to friendship. Oh. Just different. But friendship it means you're still closer. It means you can still go back together. Yeah. Like it's done. Yeah. yeah. I'm not talking. I'm, I'm not even things. looking in your direction. Yeah. <laughs> in fact, ukiangalia huko na angalia huko. And these are couples. Imagine they were the altar of Kavalisha na Pete. Yeah. And it now it's possible. done. I can only imagine shetani mgane linge hapo katikati. Uh, it is okay usually say what is not meant for you. Mm-hmm. Even if you are going to force for unaenda ku push lakini si yeah. But I'll call soulmate. Do you believe yeah. in soulmate? No, uh, no problem. <laughs> uh, you find like if the guy was mm-hmm. a family member and you came to realize that you are dating a family, maybe your sister or your brother or your cousin. Oh, that's too dirty. That's yeah. extreme. Uh, but after realizing you, uh-huh. you you had to step down. Yeah. That yeah. only I think it's expected. Mm-hmm. That only yeah, is expected yeah. so to step down. There are many situations uh, things mm-hmm. that can make you guys to just part away. Yeah. yeah. But you can still be friends with your ex. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, before I answer that, <laughs> I think I can answer the first question I have had yeah. an experience over. Oh, ile ya like umangalie huko ya mangalie huko na amjuani. Amjae juana kabisa na hata utaki mjuani. Yeah. So maybe some reasons that contributed to this you had different priorities. Maybe all you on a day mkaona nyash. Kasema this is the one. Sante uh-huh. Mungu. And maybe yeye pia aliona Lu kwenda. So if you mkianza ku date ndio na realize kumbe this is not what I want. Look so that's mm. yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. <laughs> Kuna city moja. Mm-hmm. So like first uh, impression. Yeah, yeah, first impression. Ndio inafanya most of these relationships and evil. So you to the una realize you have different priorities. What you wanted in this guy is not what he or she is. Maybe she, he was ma- masquerading the time of t- the talking stage. And the yeah. second question was about Yeah, would you still be friends with your ex? 
Because you MSMA, you can separate and I'm with your friends. But I believe friends happen with there's a possibility of you guys getting back together. Okay. Yeah. We can be friends but not close friends. I keep in touch with my ex. Oh, you keep in touch? Yeah. To just monitor if they are successful no, no, or they are suffering <laughs> after they've gone separate. Not monitor. <laughs> like, yeah, I just keep in touch with them. Mm. But not frequently. Yes, I could view status for Gotea, Kosawa. How's well, it going? Yeah. So in short, you've become a monitoring spirit. I'm okay. not a monitoring spirit. <laughs> in fact, it's mature. It's, it's being matured. Oh, for I if something ends, you should mm. not have a An contact MET. with the yeah. All right. It doesn't mean that you guys are devils. You're just human, but now with different priorities. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so I had an advice. Mm -hmm. I usually, personally, usually do. Not that I don't have an ex, I have. Yeah. But this is what I usually advise my friends. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, you feel like the relationship doesn't take you well, and yeah. you feel like you want to quit. Yeah. What you should do as a guy, you don't have to make it so uh, a big deal, funny mistake. No. Yeah. Just agree. She's a human being. Uh, mm. you, are, you are also a human being. Come together, yeah. go for a date, make it clear, pamoja. You, you end it vizuri. You know, those yeah. three, uh, our ladies are so emotional, are mm. angels, so you need to treat them well. Yeah. Who are that guy that uh, when your ex get an, a position or an opportunity somewhere can refer you still? Because uku yeah. in that state in haikuwa vizuri. Mental, mental emotional trauma. Yeah. <laughs> Because people, a lot of a lot of people have a relationship trauma. So I said, the guy used to say blah 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 mm -hmm. blah, and then you know, I'm at the chick used to say blah 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 blah, mm -hmm. or maybe they even watch it from their parents do some crazy stuff. So they still carry that trauma even to their adult life, and it becomes sure. difficult to shed it off, right? Yeah. Yeah. So the good part is just make it in a clear, positive way. Yeah, maintain the relationship in terms of being a friend, just like how you're saying. All right. Yeah. Being so friends, so it is not a, a big deal. So it's only time for us to exit. So do you guys have socials? Oh, you, you said you study journalism. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you want to be a TV presenter and radio. Sure. Ready. So tell them where they can find your socials. Cool. Hi, guys. Welcome to our first live broadcast. Sorry. So <laughs> my name is Enoch. Uh, find me on my social pages. That is Instagram, Enoch the MC, uh, Enoch underscore V underscore MC in all pages, including TikTok. I'm also a business developer, so in terms of creativity, doing business, enlarging your businesses, I'm here for you. I'm also a student, remember? Okay. And I don't want a step. In first year? <laughs> no, 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 I have a final year. Oh, oh we're yeah. in the first year. Yeah. Yes. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm Jeff, an architect student, 1.2. University of Nairobi. Hey, you may insist 1.2. Man. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm trying to erase, don't, don't chip my ego, man. I'm so, but yeah, I got you, bro. I got okay, you, I got that. you, got I'm you. I'm also a graphic designer. <laughs> yeah. I make posters. Mm -hmm. And you can find me at underscore mjak. Mm. Hey, all right. Just here. Yeah. <laughs> All right, there we go. Thank you so much, you guys, for coming through. This it? conversation has been amazing. No, you can't add another one. You can't. Yeah. Thank you for your sentiments, both of you all. And we have to end. Uh, coming up next is uh, Mata State of the Nation in just a bit at 2254 channel. At Brian Seco 101, at Stephanie Eta, at Color Me underscore. No, at Color Me Val. Yeah. So we take a break. We come back with much more. Stick around.